Hi, I'm Kenyatta. Welcome to my YouTube channel. Let's get into it, a life celebration. This is going to be a love reading for Virgo for September 2022. Love reading for Virgo for September 2022. We are going to start off with the Romance Angel Oracle deck for Virgo. Love, September 2022, Virgo. Check out my website at kenyattasintuition.com. There you can find out more about my services and my rates for readings, Virgo, as well, Virgo. Um, you find out more about my uh, other spiritual services and jewelry that I make, handmade jewelry. You will find it there on my website and pendulums. All right, Virgo, let's see what we have here for you for September 2022 in love for Virgo. September 2022, love, Virgo. September 2022, love, Virgo. September 2022, there we go, love, Virgo, September. There we go, Virgo. Let's see what we got here for you, Virgo. Honeymoon, all right. Enjoy the bliss of holiday time together, Virgo. Chemistry, Virgo. There's a strong magnetic attraction here, Virgo. And Churin's. <laughs> okay, Churin. Um, I still said Churin the same time, didn't I? Your love life is being affected by children. Le uh, I'm sorry, not Leo. I just did Leo. Virgo. I have no idea how these three come together, but I will say this, all right? There, it, you might be dealing with somebody that you have a strong magnetic attraction to. Don't that feel good when it's somebody you... Ooh, my love when it's somebody you got that strong magnetic attraction to and they got it for you too you just feel that pull it feels so nice it feels so good like yes honey all right and there might be a, for someone else or maybe you there might be a honeymoon coming up you know all right and maybe children are affecting your love life maybe maybe you got to find a ba babysitter for these children for your honeymoon Okay, who you've got this with, so you can share with this person who you've got this strong magnetic attraction to, all right? All right, uh, Virgo, I am going to be doing your reading here from the Rider Waite. Tarot deck. Rider Waite. For Virgo, for love, for September 2022. Now, I'm going to say this, Virgo. I have not said this to any other uh, reading sign so far. It just came to me, but I'm gonna say it to you and I'm gonna start saying it. I really want a really, 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 really good love tarot deck, not an oracle deck. I, you know, and so many different kinds of tarot decks out there, but I really want a good one on love. Um, I wanted one on money a long time ago, and I found one. Okay, and I'm I'm pleased with it. All right, it's specifically money for tarot. I use it. If you watch the videos, if anyone out there knows of a love deck, a tarot deck, love tarot deck, put it in the comments. <laughs> okay, put it in the comments and let me know. Okay, love my right away. I really like right away. You know, I know it's a beginner's deck. I guess that's what people say. You know, I went. To, I've gone to readers who have been reading for like. 20, 30 years, and they still use a right away. You know, it's a good deck. But I really want a, a deck that is specific for love. All right. All right. I'm going to give you one more shuffle, Virgo. And then we're going to go ahead and get this reading started for you, Virgo, in love for September 2022. And y'all gave me a whole lot of love for that uh, general reading I did. Thank you. Appreciate all the views. All right, let's get into it here. We have the Five of Swords, Upright, the Death card, Upright, upright Virgo, Nine of Swords, Upright, Seven of Wands here in reverse, Virgo, and we have the Chariot, Upright. Okay, I'm, I'm Virgo, I'm here to fight for it, okay? Fight. It's like I heard, I heard fight, I heard right, and I'm and I actually heard might. Okay, it's like fight with all your might. Okay, and I feel like this is your right, or you have a right, okay, to fight for this. This is your person, okay, or this is your um, like your relationship. Okay, you need to fight fight with this, or I mean, like fight for this. Okay, and I'm I'm even here with this. Okay, um, with this person. Okay, and of course we're not talking about any physical violence. 
sense, okay? <laughs> for, for those who may not have an understanding. <laughs> okay, that was my friend from the islands used to say. Where was she from? I think she was from St. Thomas. She used to say people just don't have an understanding. <laughs> All right. Uh, okay, so I, I, for those who have an understanding, understand, uh, not physical violence, okay, with your person, but maybe your relationship. Fight for it. Fight with this person. You all need to fight with all your might to make this work, okay? Bring the change that it is that you all are seeking. I'm telling you, if you fight for it and you work for it, the change is just on the horizon. It's like the sun is just right over through through the, you know, so y'all going through some dark times right now. You're going through some dark, dismal times right now, and it may seem like this thing is over, okay? Like it is over with, like it is kaput, but no, I'm hearing fight for it, okay? You all having some hard times right now. You, you know that song by, um, oh, is it the OJs? And we cried, cried, cried. I, I did the, the note is all wrong. Together, you know when they, 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 they you, you know what I'm talking about. They cried. Okay, I'm gonna put the uh, link to the song. Okay, in the um, description. Okay. Um, but I really like that song. Okay, but they was just, I think he was just talking about, you know how. You know, relationships that get to this point sometime, you know, and, and 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 it becomes difficult and challenging and you're going through the muck and the mire and all that kind of thing. But she didn't just cry. Or he didn't just cry. They cried together. OK, so that's what I mean when I say, you know, be in this. You all need to fight together for this thing. OK, because y'all are going through some very trying, difficult times right now. I mean, it's some hurt here. Okay, it's a lot of hurt, but I am seeing it's like and and you feel like you're not winning. Okay, and it, I don't feel like it's just you, Virgo. I feel like it's you and your person together. Okay, um, you feel like you're not winning. Like these challenges are just you know you just being blown over. Okay, now I don't know if it's something that you two are going through, just the two of you all uh, against one another. Okay, maybe somebody cheated or something like that, or maybe if it's things outside of you, like the cares of this life. You understand what I'm saying? Like just, you know, hard financial times, or maybe hard times with your children or what whatnot. But right now, I just know that you are going through a difficult time. Virgo, push on. Go forward. Keep going. Okay? Don't stop. Okay, have the will to fight for this thing. Okay, make it work. Two of Pentacles here in reverse. Virgo, Four of Wands upright. Okay, the Hermit card upright. Okay, and Eight of Pentacles in reverse. It's so funny. <laughs> I've had so many people say to me, you look like you could sing. <laughs> you look like you could blow. And I'll be like, okay. <laughs> Maybe that was in one of my past lives or some shit I could, okay? Because I don't know what y'all saying, okay? But no, I'm not a singer like that, okay? I can belt out when I really need to. But no, this one lady, she was like, I know you could blow, girl. <laughs> so I was like, okay. <laughs> no, I can't. Not really. Not like that, all right? But maybe I could if I tried. I shouldn't say I can't, okay? But we just going to move on. This is about you, Virgo, not me. All right. All right. So, yes, fight for this. You all have a home together. Maybe you're married. Okay. I don't, I got to be honest with you. I don't feel like you're married. I don't feel like you all, I feel, I don't feel like you're legally married. Okay, I don't feel like you walk down nobody's aisle and sign no paperwork, you know, for the government. I but I do feel like you all, you know, what they call um what they call when y'all live together for a long time. Um, I feel like you all have been together for a while. Okay, this is not new. Okay, this is not no new relationship. And I don't feel like you all are young people. When I say young, I mean like twenties, thirties. I feel like you all may be, you know, m middle age. Okay, or close. Okay. But you, 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 but you have a home together. Okay. But it's something happening. It's like, it's just not working. Okay. It's not working anymore. The way you used to do things. Okay. The way you all used to do things, you're trying to continue to do things in the same way. Okay. And whatever area it might be, I don't know at this particular time what area it is, but you have been doing things the same way and it always worked. Now it's not working. It's not working. And you all are trying to find some kind of way, okay? How can we make this work? Okay, it used to work, okay? But you have to understand you're no longer the same people that you were like 10, 20 years ago, okay? We grow, we change, okay? New people come in, old people go out, okay? And I feel like you all are a couple who has seen a lot of, lot of things in your life together. It's come and gone, okay? People have come and gone. 
come and gone, okay? You've seen a lot. You've shared a lot, okay? But I feel, I'm hearing distant right now, so there might be some distance. I feel like you all are trying to figure out how to make this work, but you're doing it separ separately. I feel like you're kind of starting to separate from one another, okay? And I'm hearing get back together, all right, Virgo? Let's continue on here. We have the Six of Wands upright. <clears throat> Judgment card here in reverse, all right? And we have the King of Pentacles upright, all right? Now, okay, you, I feel like you all will, if you, if you stay together, okay, in a way that you have stayed together, let that be the thing that you do that's the same, okay? Uh, however you work things out bef together before, that's the key word, you did it together, okay? Now there has been a challenge that to come, to say that old way of doing things that we did that worked for us is not working anymore, Okay, it just ain't simply ain't working, but stay together. You all can make it together just because that old way don't work no more. Okay, don't mean that it's time for you all to, to separate and split and part. I'm really seeing here that you all need to stay together as one. Okay, I don't feel like this is things that is a lack of love. We don't love each other anymore. No, I don't know what your, your time, what the, what's happening right now. It may have something, it might have something to do with your finances. Okay, it might be some kind of choice you made in the past. And it may have, it, that may be resurfacing. It may have something to do with the fact that you are not legally married because I don't think that you are. Okay, so it might be some kind of financial a thing that's coming into play. I don't know. Okay, I'm just throwing some ideas out there. Okay, Virgo. All right, but this 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 is kind of good though for you guys. Okay, because I, if you stay together and you do this together instead of this drifting apart, trying to figure things out on your own. Okay, and come together as one. Okay, because you've been together as one. All right, um, it, it it's going to be transformative for you all. OK, and I feel like it may even open up a new realm for you all. OK, a new way to see things, a new way, a new perspective on life that you hadn't seen before. That's going to be good for you, for you, for both of you and your relationship. OK. All right. Let's continue on here. We have the eight of swords upright. <laughs> Page of cups in reverse. OK, and we had a ten of swords in reverse. Listen. OK, like I said, a new way of seeing things. All right. Two heads is better than one. OK, even if it's, you know, something, even if it's not some kind of outside thing like, OK, the money messed up, you know, the pinnacles is messed up. How are we going to do this? OK, even if it's something where it's just maybe you all are clashing for some reason, all of a sudden out the blue, your personalities and whatnot are clashing. Again, it might just be the fact that you are growing, you, you're changing. OK, going into that middle age thing. That shit, listen, that shit ain't easy. OK. That shit ain't easy. The, the women be going through their period menopause and menopause. And anybody out there who have been through it, you know what that is. And we're not talking about just the physical aspect. We're talking about how it affects you emotionally and mentally as well. And spiritually. And the extra work that you have to do that you didn't have to do before when you were a young person. Shit change. And I don't care what anybody says. And you look in the mirror and you start to see some wrinkles here and wrinkles there. It don't matter if they don't, don't nobody else see them. You see them. Okay. And body morphing and changing a certain kind of way. OK, and you wake up in certain parts of your body achy and you're drinking your water, you're walking, you're exercising, you're doing all that shit. OK, you're staying on your knees in prayer, doing your meditation, blah, 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 this, that and the other. Doesn't matter. This shit will affect you. And now here's a change. And men go through andropause. OK, you can call it a midlife crisis. We're both going through this change together. There is a change here run with the change. Don't fight the change. You're not 20 no more. You're not 30 no more. Okay. Hell, you may not even be 40 no more. Okay. Don't fight the change. How can we embrace this change that we are going through together? We've embraced all these other things that have happened in our life, all these other paths, all these other, um, you know, uh, things that have happened in our lives. Okay. Um, we've embraced it all together. Okay. Now here's something else. You don't have to fight it. Okay, and fight the current and fight the tide. It's here. How can we flow with it once again together? Stay together. Don't lose the love that you all have for one another. Okay. And realize, understand, and I hope that is the case from what I'm saying, but I, I certainly hope that is the case. Um, anybody, you all, you all have to come to a, 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 an understanding. Look at the love that you all have had all these years that you all have shared with one another all these years, and you all going to have to come to an understanding. Are y'all really out to hurt one another? 
Have you ever been? Remember that. Okay. I'm going to pull here from the Psychic Tarot for the heart. Virgo. Okay. Give me a nice three-way split. Virgo. Look at this. Dreams coming true. It came out in the reverse. So maybe you're feeling like in terms of your relationship, dreams, are, you know, your dreams aren't coming true. Things are, again, happening like they used to. But also this came out. Observe. Observe yourselves. Observe one another. Observe your relationship. All right. Look at all the changes that you all have gone through. Upside down, right side up, and, and the varying degrees of whatever of life that you all have gone through. But you have done it together as what? As one. Okay, never parted, never broke each other's heart. Okay, healing begins, allow healing to begin. Whatever this thing is that is happening in your life that's causing y'all to kind of drift apart. No, come on back together so that you all can heal this relationship and have what? More success and growth. It was out like this, but we're going to put it like this so you can have more success, su success and growth in your relationship. All right, and continue what? To shine. OK, continue to shine as the couple that you are. There might be a lot of whole lot of people in your community and in your family looking at them like, man, they've been together all these years. OK, they've been through through it. OK, they haven't seen it all. But look, they shine. They are a hope and a beacon for us that, hey, we can stay together, too. We can work it out, too. I can have that kind of relationship to a committed, loving relationship. Continue to nurture each other. Don't walk away from one another. OK, just because you are headed right now in some difficult, a difficult challenge that you've never been met with before. Hey, whether you're with the person or not, the challenge, uh, the challenge is going to stay as we grow and go through the, these phases, various phases of life. We are met with new challenges. All right. Stay together. Work this out. All right, Virgo. You do what you want to do, but that's what I have for the reading. I certainly hope that resonated with some Virgo eyes that you all like, share, and subscribe. To those who have subscribed to my channel, thank you. If you have not but you watch my videos, hit that subscribe button, hit that notification bell, thumbs up, comment, come over, see what's happening here, and let's get into it. Y'all be blessed. Peace.